Hey, what's up, everybody? Farmer Kiki. Hey, I just, I'm excited to show you uh, our creation. So it's not done yet, but I just wanted to give you a video update, set a bunch of pictures. That way you can kind of look at it as we walk. So the chicken coop, of course, and I will take you for a tour of the chicken run and everything if you'd like. So here we go. I'm gonna flip you around uh, and uh, let's see if we can do this. Yeah, how do you flip the video around? Okay, so here you go. This is the new and improved. And well, here's Caitlin. She's wearing a mask. Good. This is the old chicken coop, not Caitlin. She's old though, too. Now she's 17. She's getting so old. But here's the old chicken coop. Um, it's keeping it. And here's the old chicken run. And here is the new chicken run. And just finished the roof. Looks awesome. Had some great help from Jason and Larry. Come over and help me out up there. Uh, Par Lumber, throw you out a shout for uh, Bob helping me out down there. So I still got to paint everything as well. Um, note that the siding all comes from an old rental. My man Sloan, I went and helped him and he let me take all this one by 10 cedar. I'm not done with the soffit yet, but uh, the beams, the wood, most of the wood is all from other buildings. You can see the trim here. This is all 120 year old barn wood. Um, I'm using that as my edging. Here is the old window that I got from my man, Galleon, Jake, <clears throat> bringing me some old um, windows to uh, make into some new windows. Okay, so this is what it looks like. If I come in closer, we will open the door. Uh, Don wanted one of these doors, never done this before. So here we go. There's our half door. Haven't finished that all the way yet, but it's there. Open it up. This door is from the old house that used to be behind our tea shop. Come in here. This is my favorite thing right here. This is the chicken door entry, the chicken bridge into the chicken run. And uh, of course, uh, this window is stationary. It smells like cedar in here. And uh, I use the old hardware from the windows and I'm gonna have to go to uh, get some, a brace here for this window so it can stay open. But very cool. So this is the inside. I'm going to have, here's the light for the outside. I'm going to have another light on the inside and some plug-ins for the heat lamp. So I got to build a roost over here for the birds. Don wants it to go up high so they can roost high and low. So let's go around the outside. Let's go into the chicken run. I wanted this covered because I'm going to run, run gravel, of course, here for drainage. But I just wanted uh, a cute little entry into the chicken run. All right, so check this out. This right here is the bridge. I came up with this idea. I used all this old barn wood to, uh, to trim for it. Let's go in here, check out the chickens. These are our new chickens mixed with some of the older ones. We have 19, as you may have heard before. But uh, check this out. Excuse me, a little chick chick. Here is how the chicks are going to come into their roosting spot at night. You got mail. That's right. Booyah. And I'm gonna get some rubber mat and I'm gonna seal it here, put it on here for them and right here so it's easy for them to walk up and go right in to the chicken run. So there you go. Check that out. And if we wanna shut them up, of course we just shut the mailbox. Okay. And uh, here is the uh, 20 by uh, almost nine foot covered run, as I've been talking about. There's a roost for them here. Some of their nesting boxes. These are the, they wanted some upgrades. Uh, here's the door. Um, I've got it kind of framed in, ready to go. Not really the door, but the uh, surroundings for it. Cause this is going to be the passage into the old coop when I, cause I'm going to do the same thing up here with the other coop, but probably won't get to that this year. But I might connect them all so the chickens can all connect and hang out. Uh, gate here. This is the chicken maze. You can shut this off. So we come in here. This is all covered in here. This is about 60 some, 70 feet long. Goes a foot into the ground. Come over here, chick chicks, what's up? 
Chick, chick, chick. Ciao, dog. Uh, you know, every play yard's gonna have a, a play area, so I put this together for them. And at the end of the run, all the way over here, you have uh, their little maze hangout spot that Don put together for them. This is where they were sleeping before they uh, got the covered run. So this is it. This is the little chicken run. That's a rooster, of course. So there you go. That is it. We're excited and uh, hopefully it'll be painted soon. The electrical will be in, the roost. And of course, what I haven't pointed out yet is that inside there's the uh, nesting boxes just arrived. They're gonna be metal. Don's putting them together in the house right now. So that's a surprise coming in a little bit. And uh, there's gonna be two parts of the inside. You're gonna have, uh, it's also gonna be screened off with a screened you know, wall, like with the uh, chicken wire with its own door. So you can just lift a, a little, I'm gonna make a little dory lift up so you can just take the eggs out of the nesting area. Just things that are in our head. Um, so yeah, we will give you more when it arrives. So thanks for checking out. Thanks for following the chicken craziness on the chicken farm down here. And uh, we'll keep you in the loop. And I'm sorry to those of you who just want news about Rosie the Riveter, but she's okay. She's hanging out in the smoke. All right, take care guys.